Howdy Red Dead fans and welcome. In this video, I'm going to show you some tips and tricks which will hopefully help you complete your general daily challenges. First up, the Lake Sturgeon. There are several locations on the map where you can find these large fish, but I prefer the dock at Gill's Landing. Fast travel to either Emerald Station or Rhodes and ride your horse the rest of the way to Flatiron Lake. When you arrive, use your eagle eye to check if you can see the large fish swimming in the lake. You might not actually see the fish until you take out your pole and start fishing, but trust me, it is there. Take out your fishing rod by opening your weapon wheel, then move to your item wheel and select the fishing rod. If you don't see the fishing rod in your item wheel, you'll need to buy one from the catalog. Once your character takes out their fishing rod, you'll need some bait. When fishing for Lake Sturgeon, I prefer the special Lake Lure. Open your item wheel again and move the right joystick down to your lures. Then move through the different options until you see the special lake lure and release. If you don't see this lure in your bait wheel, you'll need to purchase it from a bait shop or from the catalog. Once your lure is set, follow the on-screen prompts to cast out your line and start fishing. Since the lake sturgeon is such a large fish, you're going to want to reel slowly until the fish is on the line. The lake sturgeon will nibble a few times before taking the bait, so be patient. Once it bites, quickly hook it and start rotating the right joystick more quickly. Be careful not to reel while the fish is struggling or you'll break your line. To bring the fish in more quickly, you can pull back on the left joystick every so often, but it's best not to do this while the fish is struggling. If you can time the clockwise reeling with your right joystick and the pulling back of the left joystick correctly, you'll bring in the fish much more quickly. Next up, the panther. Again, there are several locations on the map where you can find them, most notably La Caye and south of Braithwaite Manor near Black Bell. You may even find one from time to time in Stillwater Creek. But I prefer the area around La Caye between the hours of 10 p.m. and 5 a.m. in the game. Fast travel to Le Gras and ride your horse to this area. Using Eagle Eye, you should see several animals in the area. Most of them are gators. Look for the trail of a moving animal which may be a fox, but is hopefully a panther. Once you've located the panther, point and shoot to complete the daily. Finally, spoonbills. This bird can be found in the swamps around Saint-Denis, and they are active during daylight hours. My go-to location for spoonbills is just north of the strange man's cabin. While Saint-Denis might be closer, I've found it is most effective to fast travel to roads and ride to this location on the map. If you don't see them on your first pass, try riding away and coming back. Once you've confirmed the spoonbills are there, kill and skin them to complete the daily. That's it for this video. Hopefully you found these tips and tricks helpful. Thanks for watching, and until next time, take care.